Hi y'all, this is Michelle with The Southern Shell, and I'm here to share with you another birthday surprise. Today is Mr. Grayson's birthday, our one-year-old grandson. Yay! I've already shared with you Miss Evie's birthday card, and if you'd like to check out that video, um, I'll link it below. And Grayson's whole theme from his baby shower and his bedroom was, and even his one-year-old birthday, is all safari gone wild. And so I created this card. Yeah, card. Look at this thing. It ended up being a little mini album for him. But I wanted, I, I ended up having to put a closure on the back as well because it was just so thick. But um, I wanted him to be able to have some memories of his first year. And so this opens up and it says, it's your birthday, go wild. It says you're one. When you open it up, I have pockets here. I have a magnetic closed accordion here with a little lion underneath there. And then you open the next page, and then the next, and then another accordion with magnet closure. I still have to finish decorating this. And then um, there are six pages, which means that gives me a side for each month. But you know how their first year goes. You can't just pick one picture per month. I did put some tags in here so that his mom, his dad, um, we we can, any of us, can journal anything that remem we remember specifically about him for that month. Now, my um, our youngest daughter, Megan, is a senior in college, but she is actually at home doing her studies all online. And so she helped me do some coloring for, for little Grayson's book. I used an app and I shrunk down several pictures. This one I think is just simply precious. Let me see if I can get this to focus for you. Might need to put some tape on there. That's his first bath. And he's screaming and mama's like, ah! So first time parents, first bath. I just, the camera just happened to grab that at the right moment. Just love it. So, and then of course, um, his first smile, and I was holding him, so his first smile with, was with me, his Gigi, so I absolutely love that. So there's certain ones that you just have to put in there. Um, and then, you know, Easter, and then the little five and four month little shots, and um, his first Halloween, and just so many and it's like how do you choose how do you choose um, but I made a small album when Evie was born and now it's Grayson's turn and then we have Maddie who will be one in November so I'll have to work on little Madison's album next but um, Megan and I took one evening I stamped and die cut out uh, these little wild items here. We have a, a safari guy, an elephant, his Jeep, a toucan. Um, once we colored a couple, I went ahead and just ran it through <laughs> my um, printer, um, which is also a copier, and just made a couple copies so we weren't having to um, die cut and color all of these all over again so but because I did it on copier paper I went ahead and ran that through my um, laminator so show you just how adorable these little things are how well they turned out and so on the front we have the Jeep, some little tall grass with the giraffe driving. I used some glossy accents on their eyes and on the headlights to um, the Jeep there. Now I've used different die cuts back here to cut out um, 
the monkeys and the elephants uh, for the back cover there. And I'm just going to go through and this um, binding was new for me, a little different. It was fun. Um, you can see here, it just has the little corners. If you'd like to see how I put that together, I'd be happy to share that with you. Um, I seen this, oh my goodness, I can't even remember Ooh, who I seen it through. Um, but she had seen it through um, a video of a lady over in Germany and she didn't understand the language. And so I just kind of... Um, took some measurements and decided what I needed and went for it from there and it turned out real well. I'd probably next time put something a little sturdier over the binding on the outside. I used a real good cardstock so it's not going to do anything but um, I just don't like the way it looks open um, where you can see the see the binding like that. So I'll probably do something different next time around but it's always a learning um, experience when you're doing something new but if you would like to see how I did that I'd be happy to reproduce another one like I said I have another grandbaby turning one in November so I wouldn't um, mind at all to put another one together on camera so I hope that um, you like this I'm gonna have a blast his birthday party is Sunday and I'm going to have a blast just putting these pictures in and enjoying seeing him um, devour his cake. So I wish that we were able to go up to um, visit Evie, but she is so far away. And Mr. Grayson is, is only about 15 minutes. So that makes it nice that we have one, of a, one group of them close and... And the other is, um, we do get to see a couple times a year, but it, it is more difficult, and we do miss them a whole lot. So, if, thank you guys so much for tuning in to look at this birthday card that I'm making. And um, I'll put pictures in at the end to show you what it looks like when I'm all done. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch my video. I hope you're all staying safe out there. God bless. I love you. And bye for now. I decided I'm going to go ahead and film putting this together. Whether it makes it in on the video or not, I'm not sure yet. But we shall see. So...
Well guys, that's about all I'm going to stick in this for now. It's nice and thick. I've got the extra pictures and extra embellishments so that I can give it to them and they can write their memories down and enjoy it with Grayson. So let's see what we've got done here. Besides a mess. I am a messy crafter, guys. So, we have a good, strong magnet in the back. And I have the back pieces, <laughs> woohoo, covered up. And this can also open up so they can have it sitting out if they wanted to. So, and they don't have to necessarily have it closed up. But, we have first bath, first month old, one month old. It's first Halloween. And we're going into fall. And here's fall, Thanksgiving. And these um, embellishments that I put on here, um, these are some that I used. Um, I had extras from the embellishment swap that I, I did. And these are some that I sent out on my embellishment swap. I sent out those and then these particular ones here are some that I die cut out of uh, sticker paper. So those turned out real cute. And then this was a sticker pack. And of course this first Christmas and I'm sure they'll have plenty that they'd like to put in there. And then um, there's, you know, 4th of July and all kinds of other things. So let me know, guys, if you would like to see a tutorial on how I did this. Um, if you have any suggestions, I should have made it a little thicker. I, I should have known better, but this was just too much fun. So thank you for watching. I hope you guys are all staying safe out there. I appreciate your time. If you like what you see and you'd like to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button. If you want to know when I'm uploading more, hit that bell button. God bless, be safe, and bye for now.